Learning to use WooCommerce to start a store can have a learning curve, but let me show you a plugin that can save you a lot of time and doesn't have to use WooCommerce. It's called North Commerce and it's way easier to use. So let me show you right now. What's up everyone? So I want to show you North Commerce, which is a super easy to use plugin instead of using WooCommerce. This is great for people who are not tech savvy or if you are building a store for someone and they don't want to use WooCommerce because WooCommerce has a lot of things going on there. You're going to need a lot of plugins to get it going the way you like it. In this case, North Commerce is going to make things really easy. Right now, they have a lifetime deal that you can grab for $49 for one website. But if you need more websites, I definitely recommend that you check out license tier two or three and all the way up to four with unlimited sites. So if you are a marketing agency, unlimited sites is the way to go. Now, the idea of this, like I said, is for non tech savvy users. Now, before I show you how to use North Commerce, let me show you the sponsor for this video, which is Hostinger. You can grab affordable shared hosting plans here. So if you go to my link in the description, go to hosting web hosting, you can check out the plans that they have right here. You can grab a business plan for $3.99 a month. Now, there's an extra discount coupon code that I want to show you how to apply. So let's add this to our cart. And once you're here, it's going to ask you how many months do you want to pay in advance? So I recommend 48 months. You lock in the lowest price, lowest renewal price, and you're good to go for 48 months. Now, for, to apply that extra discount coupon code, this is the price right now. But if you add my coupon code, which is SAS Master, the price is going to drop to $172.37. Remember, that's for 48 months. So it's a great deal. All right. So this is North Commerce. And like I said, it's super easy to get started. Obviously, the first thing you want to do is head on over to settings and set up your store with your logo, your details, etc. And that will be found right here. So you want to add your license from the one you purchased, your shipping and delivery methods. So you can add shipping pro profiles here, custom shipping rates, local delivery and local pickup. So not many uh, details and options like you would have on WooCommerce. WooCommerce can get crazy with a lot of options, OK? You got the name for a store, your logo, your location, your standard format, store currency, your products, card. You got some icon options here, card colors, etc., and all that good stuff here with the tax options there. Okay. Sync products. So if you want to sync them, notifications, API docs. You got webhooks with this, which is really interesting because you can do a lot of connections and send out some details in Zapier, Pally Connect, Make, etc., with this your event log, and that you're good to go with the options. Next, you want to do is integrate with your payment gateways. Now, in this case, there's PayPal, Stripe, Molly, and Square. If you need another payment gateway that is more local, this would not be the option for you. You would need to head up to WooCommerce and add that payment gateway there. But if you're good to go with these ones, this is way easier to use. Now, to add a product, how difficult is it? Well, just go to products, add a new product, one time subscription or a payment plan. In this case, it's a one time. I'll just say test here, test for description. You got your product image. I'll just select the image that I have right here. Go ahead and select it. The SKU for this, the quality, unlimited, or is there stock? So I'll just say 100. Will this have shipping if it's a physical product? Yes. And this weighs one kilo and 400 grams. The price is 100 and it's compared to 150. And how much was the cost price? Because it's going to give you the margin for this. Here's the margin. Does it have variants? So if it's a T-shirt, something like that, and you got small, medium, large, etc., you can have variants here. Custom information. So it's a merchandise, documents, skip, etc. The code for that. Okay, and publishing immediately, schedule or don't publish. Select the category here. I'll just say test. Add that category. The tags. I'll just say test again, and save the product. I just created a product right now. Okay, so it's now saved. I can go ahead and view it right here. Remember, I didn't add anything fancy, just one image, price, etc. Nothing fancy going on right there. Okay, so that's how easy it is. Let's go back. I'm going to be able to view all my products here. I can turn them off. I can publish them. I can delete them, edit them, etc. Here's a publish, draft, archive, scheduled, and trash. Super easy to do. Now, customers, again, same thing. If I want to add a customer, here's the details and it's added already. Want to create a coupon? Again, super easy. Add the coupon here. So you got your code, your usage. If it's going to be unlimited, generate a code. The mode is going to be automatic. Discount type, percentage, or fixed. Free shipping, requirements, apply products, etc. All this information available, the active date, and you're good to go to create a coupon. Super easy, right? 
and then you have your overview for everything that is going on okay so you got your overview of sales total orders average values etc with the information right here and the orders one by one right here so you got your creative fulfilled partially fulfilled so it's a super easy to use store that you can build right now now all the pages are going to be created automatically with this so you got your my account you got your card your checkout etc and you can connect these to the menu the way you would do it is go to appearance go to menu and add the the north commerce pages here so for example i created this one which i give you my card my products and my checkout from here so if i go to store i have my drop down here so i can view my card my products and my checkout these are pages that were created with north commerce automatically so as i mentioned if you're looking for something simpler than woocommerce that can be easy to use that your clients can use super easy you can make it it's basically i mean step by step right but you can make a video for this that makes it super easy for them to use this would be the way to go but if you're looking for something more complex with more options and more plugins etc then this is not for you okay you have a 60 day money back guarantee in case you want to check this out and there you go link we provided in the description and that's a wrap